He claimed he robbed a credit union in South Lyon because he was out of options and had a child who needed chemo treatments. So did an Oakland County judge show mercy? Let's bring in Mara McDonald. Mara, man had a lot to say at sentencing today. There are some days in court when a defendant is getting sentenced that perhaps it is better that he does not open his mouth. And today was just that day. Take a look. All I think about is my daughter. I never harm no one, never gonna hurt anyone. I'm not a bad person at all. Brian Randolph claimed he held up a South Lion Credit Union because he needed to pay for his daughter's chemotherapy appointments. That's the story he told the police, press, and judge. One small problem, according to the prosecutor. Uh, from what he did after the crime, after he got to someone is not sympathetic. He did go to Chicago, he did, did go on a shopping spree. When he was arrested in his car, there was a receipt inside of a Gucci bag from 8 13, the day after the robbery. From Somerset Mall at 7 13 p.m., he purchased a t shirt for $190, a pair of slippers for $160. In addition, there's an HM bag with a receipt from the day before. That where he purchased uh, on that day, that morning, to purchase full day on Michigan Avenue in Chicago. You heard right. He went on a shopping spree to Somerset and to Michigan Avenue in Chicago. The judge was not amused. And then telling the media, oh, I did it to save my daughter while you're running to Chicago and going on a shopping spree. And now you're standing here in front of me, you send me all these letters, and you tell me what a wonderful guy you're not. You're not, you're a bank robber. The judge was so thoroughly not amused, he sentenced him to 3 to 25 years in prison and is demanding $5,000 in restitution. Mara McDonald, Local 4. Well, you don't often hear judges react so strongly. Not the usual day in court. Really, uh, 